My name is Paul Arulu, and I'm here to speak about how Nollywood is growing and the indicators responsible for its growth. I consider Nollywood as a phase one, phase two, phase three, phase four project. The phase one is simply the introduction to, uh, to Nollywood, which happens, which could be dated back to 1960s, 1970s. The filmmakers then travel around the country with their dance and drama troupe, perform on the different stages, on a different location, and they are getting paid for it. So this is the introduction to Nollywood to Nigerians. And uh, the phase two could be dated back to late 1980s to 2010. This is the VHS era. This is an era whereby a lot of films have been made. And this made Nollywood to become the largest movie market in Africa. 40 to 50 movies have been made weekly in Nigeria alone. That is huge. And 2,500 to 3,000 movies have been made yearly in Nigeria alone. And all these films have been exported throughout Africa to countries like Ghana, Cameroon, Benin Republic, Zambia, name it, all other countries in Africa. So, Nollywood gained a lot of popularity in this era. The third era is the new cinema era. This is an era whereby big, big project is required by filmmakers. And because of the fact that in as much they are making a lot of, a lot of movies in the second era, which is the VHS era, they don't get to do big project. They don't get to do big equipment project movie. All these high class movies, they don't get to do because of low funding. But in the new cinema era, in the third, in the third era, which happens to be 2009 to 2016, there is a whole lot of funding for filmmakers to, I mean, to achieve their big project with the aid of government and private stakeholders. So, uh, since 2016 now, I can say we are now in the phase four of Nollywood, which happened to be the streaming era. By 2017, Nollywood, uh, Netflix, has came on board, then Prime, Paramount, a whole lot of them are now in Nigeria to, to stabilize the industry. New developments have been, uh, have been arised and then uh, new departments have been, uh, have been formed in the industry, which happens to be the distribution department, the marketing department. So filmmakers doesn't need, necessarily need to stress themselves how to market their product anymore because Netflix and a whole lot of them can do this for them because they are funding the project. So this alone has really helped the industry. Nollywood is now the second largest movie, second largest movie in the, in the whole world. And it has the financial value of $6.4 billion as of 2021. And its employ, uh, employment strength is 1 million, uh, 1, 1 million jobs all over Nigeria for the past five years alone. That is 1 million people. So Nollywood is huge right now. Kudos to everybody, kudos to the active players. Thank you.